Fixed-wing aircraft consists of different components such as fuselage, wings, flight control surfaces, stabilizer, landing gear. These components, which are the part of the airframe, are assembled together using rivets, bolts, screws, and different welding techniques. Now, we discuss different structural members which are used in this airframe. Components to understand that how an aircraft is built. Construction of fuselage. There are two types of fuselage constructions. Truss type, monocoque type. Truss type. A truss type consists of steel or aluminum tubes which are welded together all the tubes carrying tension and compression loads. This type of construction can be seen on small single engine aircraft. Monocoque type. There are two monocoque type fuselage constructions. Complete monocoque, semi-monocoque. Complete monocoque. Complete monocoque structure consists of aircraft skin, formers, frames, bulkheads. In the complete monocoque structure, aircraft skin is primary load carrying member, so the strength of the skin plays a major role in this type of construction. Semi monocoque. Semi monocoque structure consists of aircraft skin, formers, frames, bulkheads, longerins, stringers. Semi monocoque. In the semi monocoque structure, Skin is not the primary load carrying member. The load is distributed to these structural component members such as skin, formers, frames, bulkheads, longerins, and stringers. Semi monocoque. Most modern aircraft have a semi monocoque type of fuselage since it's a fail safe design. This means that failure of single structural component will not have an impact on the safety of the fuselage.